Welcome. In this tutorial, we'll be going over the execution of a report. Let's start off by selecting our report template in the box labeled template. We'll be executing the same report that we created in the report creation basic tutorial, parking time report. Next, we'll select the object, which is dependent upon the report type. For a short example, the unit group type of report can pull data on both a unit and a unit group. I won't go too deep into this as we'll go into much more detail later in the advanced tutorial. Now we have the date tool. There are several ways to operate this tool as well. First, we have specified interval. After clicking the time input box, a calendar will pop up. First, choose the start and end time for your report and then click on the correct date. The second option starts from until today. It's a bit easier, just like the specified interval. You'll enter the from date and it will pull all the information from that date until your current time. The last of these three options is my personal favorite. The reason is, is because it's one of the more useful intervals. It's because it encaptures how reports are usually requested. All I need to do is select the quantity of time, for example, two, and then the unit of time, whether that be a minute, hour, day, week, or month. Lastly, on the bottom, you can select the checkbox including current. This way, you choose to include the current unit of time. For example, if a report lasts two weeks, then by choosing this box, you will see data for this week and the previous week. Whereas without it, you would only see data for the previous week and the week before that. Now you can execute the report on the object selected. And to the right, we'll see our second panel render. This is how we know that our report pulled successfully. Congratulations and thank you for completing our tutorial on the report execution. I hope by now you feel a little more at ease when operating through our platform. To further extend your knowledge of our platform, check out our other video tutorials. I'll see you next time.